Okay, this is Zero, and I'll be showing you today how to reassemble an 06 cyborg. Not just kidding, we'll show you how to program one. Uh, this is not going to really apply to an 07 cyborg or a droid. It's a different board, unless you put an 06 board in there. I don't know if the 04 and 05 are done the same way, but anyway. Actually, they are done the same way, all of them, except the RX, but you'll have different numbers for your different settings and stuff. So, it'll be done the same but your settings will be different. Anyway, turn, turn your cyborg on. You can see there's no buttons or anything to turn it on. There's a little flip switch on the top here of the frame. Just slide it forward, it comes on instantly. Red, solid means nothing in the breach. Something in the breach will turn green. You fire and it senses it didn't move. You know, it'll, uh, you can't really see any indication, but It'll actually slow itself down to, I think, 11 or 13 volts a second to make sure you don't chop. You turn your eyes off, you hold down the trigger, that first click, that means clearing shot, so it will fire the shot even when the eyes are on. You hold down longer than that, and it'll start flashing. Flashing red means eyes off. So there you go, PSP 3 shot, 30 PPS. Let's say I want to change that down to semi auto capped at. 13. First thing I do, turn it off, pull the trigger and hold it down, turn it back on. Blue light means programming mode. Pull it twice to go into the rate of fire, it'll flash 30 times, which is showing me it's capped at 30. So pull it 13 times, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. If I actually wait for it to uh, do the 30 flashes, it would have stopped. After the two pulls, it would have flashed twice to show it's acknowledging the programming. Now it's kept at 13. Pull it once, it should show me 10 flashes. Yep, that means PSP 3 shot. Pull it once for semi-auto, and since it's going out of the firing mode, it'll actually go back into, uh, well, actual playing mode. So now, no more ramping. Straight semi-auto. That's uh, the same way you program all your settings, except instead of being number two and number one, it'll be other numbers. I don't actually remember all the things, but there's a manual on macdev.net for the 06 board. There's also a manual on fixmyangel.com. No, the angelguide.com. You go to predator manuals because the uh, stock 06 cyborg board is programmed by, who is it, Tag Sports, has predator code on there. That's how you would program your 06 cyborg, as well as any other cyborg. But like I said, you'd have different settings, but it would be done the same way to get into the programming mode and change your settings. That's it.